It takes a talented team to take care of our patients throughout the Department of Radiation Oncology and specifically here in the Proton Center at MGH. There are many steps in the treatment process and each step along the way requires the expertise of multiple specialists. After the patient is seen by their oncologist, they'll all need a mobilization of some type. This area where I work is called the mold room. There you go, there it is. And that's how warm the mask material is. We build custom mobilizations to each patient. It helps them get in a reproducible position and gives them the tools to work with us to stay perfectly still so the proton beam can be delivered as accurately as possible. Just a few more minutes. Fantastic. And there you are. After a visit to the mold room, the patient heads to our CT simulator to obtain a three-dimensional CAT scan in the position that they will be treated in. Once the CAT scan is completed and the physician has outlined the tumor volume and the normal structures, dosimetry will create a treatment plan to deliver the prescribed dose to the tumor and spare all the surrounding normal tissues. This is the machine shop where we make the range compensators and the apertures. This hardware helps to ship the proton beam to match the size and shape of the tumor. The cyclotron that accelerates the protons for treatment weighs 220 tons. Inside the cyclotron, an electric field speeds up the protons. Magnetic coils keep the protons on a circular path. When they reach their final energy, they're traveling at 400 million miles per hour. Computer-controlled magnets direct the proton beam to the treatment room. A three-story, 100-ton gantry allows the beam to be delivered to the patient from any angle. We have a team of medical physicists, therapists, and engineers who are required to perform quality assurance checks on all aspects of the treatment before and during the actual delivery. Prior to the patient coming in the treatment room, we'll insert the aperture and compensator into the snout of the machine. The aperture and compensator match the patient's unique tumor size and shape. Oh, hi. hi. We're all set hi. for you. Nice to see you. Hop right up. All right, I'm going to steal your hat before you lie down. During the treatment, we carefully monitor the patient on an audiovisual system just outside the treatment room. Before the treatment session even begins, there's been a highly orchestrated process to offer the most precise radiation treatment currently available. As a cancer survivor myself, it, it's really meaningful and rewarding to me to see quality, safe treatment every day. We're really privileged to be able to take care of patients.